So guys, welcome to another video. Today's video is going to be a little bit different than you guys are used to. I'm here with Rene, he is also a YouTuber here in the Netherlands, that Dutch car guy. And today we're going to work on a Subaru, guys. <laughs> it's like I said, it's not what you guys are used to from me. It's a little bit different. Yeah. <laughs> um, we're going to mount Air Ride on this car today. Uh, of course, he drove, he drove his car today to the shop yep. and he's going to drive it home yep. at, the, at the end of I'm going to say that it's my daily driver, so I have to. Yeah, exactly. Um, but, but it's not an airlift system with digital management. It's no, an it's old analog, school analog system. Analog system. Yeah, uh, similar as the, as the GLI. Um, Frank is also on its way to the shop. He's going to help us out with the air ride system. So it will be um, yeah, the suspension, uh, the trunk, cables and hoses. Yeah, very excited for this new project guys. And yeah, shout out to That It's Car Guy. Check him out. I will uh, put the information about his channel in the description below. And yeah, let's move some cars because all the bridges are like full now on the lift um, so we're going to switch some cars and let's go guys <laughs> so guys we moved the cars a little uh, we parked the mark one under the track day golf gli is under the audi a4 and renee is now pulling on The sound of the Subaru, man. It's something different, right? So we have the Subaru on the left now. Uh, Rene is busy with uh, taking off the wheels. And Frank is already busy with fitting the new um, yeah, quick release uh, hose clamps. Or <laughs> how, do you, how do you want to call it? Um, yeah, we had to put some planks on the ground. Otherwise, we were not able to fit the arm from the lift. Uh, because of the, the side skirt extenders, he made them uh, by himself from ca uh, carbon. No, it was it was a polyester base, but the carbon work I did myself. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And this he made completely uh, by himself with like a cardboard, uh, cardboard <laughs> mall. Yeah, a cardboard, a lot of imagination and uh, a lot of cutting. Yeah, yeah. I really, really love the the time and effort he he put into this car. A lot of custom stuff. Yeah, it's something different, guys. Something different. So we have everything here on the ground. We have uh, new hoses, six mil, cable, um, yeah, valve block from uh, Bonhof. It were uh, the. Um, the suspension was from airlift, right? Yeah, the suspension is airlift. Yeah. It's an airlift suspension with a base set of uh, air ride system. So this is the system you see about 15 years ago. Yeah. It's all analog. It's just a uh, base, uh, base steps compressor, uh, analog tools. Yeah. And this is something beautiful. It's an old school uh, uh, remote control. So if I'm outside of the car, I can old school play with the car, yeah. and turn it up and down. And I had a, a few cars on air rides like 10 years ago. And the funniest thing is if kids are around the car and it's really, really low, then you stand on the, uh, uh, on the corner and the most beautiful thing is you put it up. Oh, what the fuck? Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> kids' reactions are the best. Yeah, kids yeah, yeah. Are really the best. <laughs> Yeah, also the GLI is like my first car on, uh, on, on an airlift system. And still, I completely cracked my front lift. <laughs> <laughs> when they was, was like, how is it possible, man? You went fucking airlift. <laughs> it's possible because we are guys who want to drive low. Yeah, we want to drive low, even you when we have airlift. Yeah, if you, if you drive up, you break things. Yeah, yeah exactly. 
So, uh, yeah, man. Let's um, take off all the wheels and rip off the original or the coilover set. Let's go, guys. So guys, we took off the wheels and I'm very happy with how the suspension is mounted. It's almost like a Mark II Golf. <laughs> I really thought at first, I thought, oh, it's going to be a pain in the ass to work on a, on a Subaru. Because for me, it's the first time working in a Subaru. But, um, yeah man, it's, it's like very, very easy. There are like two bolts here. And you have the camber, uh, the camber plate, it's mounted with three bolts. And then the complete, the complete front suspension is, yeah, you can take it off. And on the rear, it's a similar, similar system. So it's very, very easy. But to take the cuts <laughs> off, it's a nightmare! And with the bank to take the bank off. So the, also a nice, nice thing, he bought the complete air ride system from a friend of him. And of course this system is also from a similar Subaru. So the complete uh, trunk uh, kit, yeah, it's a straight fit. So we, we, really, um, we really don't have to uh, customize a lot of things. We only have to mount the suspension mount the the valve the valves and the tanks and the compressor in the in the trunk and yeah putting the lines some electrical work and then we are finished so yeah i'm very curious how long it's going to take to yeah to have the car finished hey, on the hey, ground hey we have to, we have to see the formula one in the afternoon so oh it's also today yeah, yeah i thought always always i'm thinking about oh, i have to check the, uh, the formula one but every uh, every time i, I forget I, I, I really don't care but my girlfriend said please be home for before the formula one because i have the kids i want to watch yeah <laughs> <laughs> oh man uh, so yeah guys that's what we're going to do now rip off the suspension and we're going to straight up mount the airlift uh, suspension back and yeah, work our way to the trunk so let's go man so we wanted to mount the suspension but we came by the conclusion that the lower part of the suspension are switched so you have like the now the air bulk, or I, I don't know how to call it in English. And you have a sleeve right here. So this is the rear, this is the front. But on the lower side, or the lower part of the suspension, um, the mounting points are switched out. So luckily it's possible to, yeah, to screw them off. Screw them loose. And yeah, we have to switch. Yeah, we have to switch them out. So that's what we're going to do now. Renee is busy with, um, yeah. with the inside of the car. He took the bolts off. Yeah, the the rear seat out. So yeah, a little setback, but nothing, nothing major. Guys, we thought it would be easy <laughs> to take off the bushing, the mounting uh, bushing, but it's like completely stuck. We are almost there, but yeah, it's it's really a pain in the ass. And also, like the cream on the cake, the the hose, the hose broke off, snapped off. It snapped <laughs> off. So now we have a friend of ours. Jurgen uh, from Brabant Customs. Um, yeah, we, we're going to pick up a new house. Glenn also came by with the sick ass Mark 6 Gold. 
Um, so yeah, now we go to Vught, to Brabant Customs, pick up a new hose, and yeah, so we can finally mount the <laughs> suspension, guys. So we're going to bring, going to take the GLI, and yeah, man, it's always something, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go, man. <laughs> <laughs> Kijk hem leeg hier. <laughs> Kleur is wel echt dik hè? Ja, die zeker. So we are back in the shop, we picked up, <laughs> we picked up the stuff at uh, Brabant Customs. We needed some uh, new nipples and uh, yeah, it's finally ready to be mounted man. We are like almost three hours away. Three hours, four hours man. Hey, keep it, uh, keep it. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, we have all the stuff now, we can finally mount. <laughs> okay guys, let's go man. <laughs> So it took a while, I did it as nice as I could with the materials that we have right now. So this is like uh, for temporary, temporary use. But I used some uh, wood and placed the valve cover, the compressor, air compressor made with a bolt, with an M8 bolt. I made the a gr a central ground point. And yeah, we used the cable that's originally for um, a tow hook, <laughs> for a tow hook, but it, it, do, it does the job, it does the job, guys. Also, um, Rene and Frank were busy with mounting all the airlines, so the airlines are also, almost all of the airlines are also almost uh, connected. So guys, we can mount the, the setup right here in the trunk, connect the wires to the, to the buttons, and yeah, I hope that the car will be finished straight away, because I'm very tired, I slept like three hours uh, yesterday. Frank also, <laughs> he's like a walking zombie around here. <laughs> I slept about eight hours, so, and I have kids. Yeah. <laughs> but we already said if we finish within one hour or one and a half hour, we are going to, sushi! A, to a sushi restaurant. So, yeah, man, we have some motivation now. <laughs> <laughs> so, but yeah, I'm. I'm happy with the results of the setup right here. 
we had we had a little um, yeah we had a little uh, throwback with the um, suspension that was all switched out it was all very very stuck then we um, we were missing some parts I went to uh, a company to buy some parts uh, the guy especially came to to his um, yeah, to his shop especially for us so yeah guys it, it is what it is it's like I said uh, before it's always something <laughs> and it happens but it, the most important thing is that we make the best of it so yeah, let's work further a little bit let's finish up this Subaru and yeah, man, let's quickly go to eat man because I'm very hungry and I'm sure Frank, Frank, I hear Frank and stomach right here. <laughs> so guys, no time to waste. Let's go, man. So guys, I finally have all the electronics done. Um, it's now the moment of truth, if it all works. So here we go, guys. <laughs> Fingers crossed, Renee. So I have two buttons here and a, and a kill switch. Yeah! Hey! That's what you're working. Okay, yeah, now we have to wait till we have some air. Yeah. And then we can test the buttons. <laughs> so we have pressure and then. Uh... Good, then there was a lot of air. So, guys, the air compressor. It uh, shut it down, it shut it off uh, by the sensor, so that's also a good thing. Um, so now it's, it's the real moment of truth. We're going to lower down the lift and we're going to press the buttons, guys, and let's see what happens. Yeah, are you ready, Renee? Very ready. <laughs> yes. Because when we drove the car on the lift, we need wooden planks. Because this is the lowest and the car now is like stuck on the lift. So here Frank, take the camera. Uh,
like my videos, feel free to subscribe, smash that like button, and see you guys in the next one. Ciao!